in the comments, please feel free to leave a favorite episode, favorite Tommy moment, favorite Jason David Frank meeting at a convention or story. Obviously a very big loss for the Power Rangers community, for Tommy fans, for Jason David Frank fans, for people that knew him personally, for friends, family. I did a little interview with Jason at Comic-Con back in 2014 and the room was just very loud and I ended up not using the footage because the audio was really bad, but I, I was trying to get like a positive message to bring back for the channel. I had asked him, you know, what do you say to all the fans that love the show, that collect the toys and have friends or family that either say you're too old or kind of make fun of or you know, in some cases, bully. Everybody, man, has their heroes in life, you know? And, yeah. and I get this a lot, like, hey, you changed my life. You know, you, in the show, the person behind is like, how can a show change your life? It's like, well, music, you have memories of music. You'll listen to a, a music song, and it'll take you back in the time. And you'll, so it's the same thing with TV shows. They kept a lot of kids entertained when, you know, t times were tough. This was their escape, and I think it was a good positive escape. Look at Big Comic Con. If we're all too big, Big, we would have nobody here. Never to, you never tour. You never tour. I always say there are so many worse things that kids could be doing or buying than Power Ranger toys. Yeah. Well, I agree. <laughs> I, agree. Hey, I mean, it's it's not hurting anybody. No. I'm sure many of us have positive memories attached to you know to Mighty Morphin, especially people that are that grew up with the show. I still remember where I bought my first Tommy figure, and uh, you know like what else was going on in my life when I was watching Mighty Morphin when I was younger. It's it's sad, you know? I, I didn't know him like in real life, like I didn't know him personally, but you know, it's sad. It's, it's It really is. Um, if it's any comfort, Tommy Oliver is still alive. He will continue to live on in over 200 episodes of the TV series, movies, comics, toys, your, your personal displays. As for Jason, you know, he was obviously dealing with more things than probably a lot of fans realized. I, I was certainly surprised to see this news. Hopefully he's at peace now.